I call them three-dimensional photo mosaics. Sometimes it starts with the iconic image. I love Steve Martin, I love his comedy, I love his, his mind, and I thought I want to do a piece about him. My goal was to really engage people. If they're walking by, they see, oh, that's interesting. And then if they look closer, they think, oh, oh, why is Rob Reiner in there? Then they'll stay a while, and they keep discovering things. My then boyfriend at the time, now husband, he got transferred to London, so I found a job in London in advertising. I kept seeing mosaics everywhere. I worked with you know, illustrators and photographers there, so I wondered, you know, I wonder if I can combine that myself. I do all the research, and I make a huge list, and then I will do a layout myself on the computer, and then I convert them. I'll crop the photo, turn it, turn it, brighten it up, keep moving it and keep inserting it in my layout until I'm happy. And then cutting everything by hand and adhering it and doing all the tiles. Part of me working on these mosaics was also, I was really involved on Ancestry.com. Always the one to ask the grandparents, the aunts, the uncles, what's the history behind that? What's the story behind that? And then when we moved back to Chicago, I started to have kids and I would take a lot of photos. A lot of friends would just say, can you photograph my kids? So I thought, what if I made that into a mosaic? It blossomed from there. So people to keep coming back to it is what I really, what really makes me continue to do more.